The suspect's family on one side, the victim's family on the other, and one by one, the five teenagers made their way before Superior Court Judge Alberto Tolentino for their arraignment. 18-year-old Derek Cruz, charged with murder. Mr. Cruz, the court record's going to reflect that you're present here with your lawyer in the public defender's office. You weigh the reading of the indictment you're pleading not guilty to the charges. 19-year-old Cal Jerome Delore, also charged with murder, not guilty. 16-year-old Zared Lizama, facing a murder charge as well, not guilty. 17-year-old Shane Terlahi, the alleged driver in the getaway car, not guilty. 16-year-old Darren Cruz, charged with hindering apprehension and destruction of evidence for allegedly burning his brother's bloody shirt. His arraignment postponed until April 7th because of a change of attorney. The indictment lists 16 charges, ranging from murder to burglary, robbery, unlawful restraint, and possession of an unregistered firearm. They all remain imprisoned on a half million dollars bail each, all of them still teenagers, three of them minors being tried as adults, all of them more than a decade younger than 31-year-old Vince Pareto, whose murder they are accused of being involved in. During the court proceedings today, a Pareto family member could be heard audibly grunting while the suspects were let in. Judge Tolentino ordered the family member out of his courtroom. Marshal, uh, Marshal Tarua. You know, there's a noise that's distracting the proceedings, if you would. According to the magistrate's complaint, three of the teenagers admitted to police that they broke into Pareto's home on March 8th to steal marijuana, tied him up, and beat him with a baseball bat, after which they walked out with black bags full of marijuana. A trial date will be scheduled on April 23rd for Derek Cruz, Delore, and Lizama. Terlahi, who called for a speedy trial, will have a trial date set on April 4th. Darren Cruz's arraignment was postponed until April 7th. Kevin Kerrigan, PNC News.